Good morning. Welcome to Big Al's Eats. We're getting ready to do some, we're going to do some uh, grilled potatoes. And uh, let me go ahead and get those started. I've got some potatoes that I parboiled and uh, cut them in bite-sized pieces. What I'm going to do, I'm going to put a little olive oil down on the blackstone. Let me cut this eye on over here. Put a little olive oil down, and we're going to get these potatoes to cook. Put this oil around. Going to, do, going, uh, going to do a couple of eggs, going to do some sausage, and these potatoes. And uh, with these potatoes, I have added, I'm going to add some uh, Zydeco Chop Chop to them. Zydeco Chop Chop, if you've never tried it, you need to order some. Cajunbait.com. They can hook you up. Nice potatoes. Let's spread them out a little bit. These are already done, so all we're going to do is just put a little brown on them, get a little crust on them. And I've got, where's it at? There it is. I've got some rehydrated Zydeco Chop Chop. Going to add that right over the top. Oh gosh, when that, when that Zydeco hits this griddle, oh man, ain't nothing like it. And now I'm going to add just a little, little drizzle of oil on the top of the potato. And I'm going to go ahead and stir them a little bit. And we're going to let these cook about 5 or 10 minutes, you know, never how long it takes to get a little crust on. I like them a little brown, you know what I mean? Alright, we'll spread these out. And I've got some, uh, I've got some sausage. And I'm on a, a, it's a link sausage, and it's a beef link sausage. I'm gonna cut it up, add it to the potatoes. So uh, stick around. I'm gonna cut it up. We'll be right back. Okay, we've got the sausage cut up. Let me show you this sausage. This is one little link of sausage. I'm gonna add it right on top of the potatoes. I'm gonna stir it around a little bit. I'm gonna put a little water on there, create a little steam. Zydeco Chop Chop is like the holy trinity. Uh, bell peppers, onions, uh, it's got two different kinds of bell pepper in there, garlic, all kind of goodies, celery, it's the, it's the trinity. A little more olive oil on top. There we have it. We'll let that go for a minute. I'm going to go to the refrigerator, I'm going to get a couple of eggs out, and uh, I'm going I'm to cook a couple of eggs. These potatoes have been cooking for a few minutes now. I'm going to season a little bit with some Zydeco. I mean, why do I keep saying Zydeco? I've got Zydeco on the potatoes. Cajun bait, garlic blend, great on potatoes, y'all. Sprinkle a little over the top. And we'll stir that in. Get it all distributed in there. We want it seasoned up nicely. This this the smell is absolutely amazing. Yeah, go over to uh, CajunBait.com and order you some Zydeco Chop Chop along with the three blends of uh, the Cajun Bait seasoning. Okay, what I've done, I've moved the potatoes off to the side and what I've done, I've cut each, I've got three burners on this Blackstone, uh, uh, two on each end, I have got running on low. The one in the center here, it's off. I saw, I've got to give a, a young man a shout out. He's got a YouTube and a Facebook page called The Hungry Hussy. Uh, I've watched a couple of his videos and stuff, and uh, uh, I'm giving him a shout out this morning. I watched one of his videos where he shows how to cook an egg on the Blackstone. And, and 
to me, an egg is the hardest thing to cook. You know, I like those yellows, those yolks and those eggs. I like them runny. And uh, I tend to overcook them. But the trick is, is to cook it slow. And I've, I've lowered the temperature and, and cooking them slow, letting the egg take its time and, and flip it before you think you need to. It turns out great. Uh, Y'all go over and check out The Hungry Hussy. He's got some great videos, very, very informative. So uh, first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put some butter down in the center. And like I say, I've got the, this burner in the center. It is in the off position, no heat. And these outside too, they're on low. So I'm gonna put a tablespoon of butter down. And, and like, uh, like Matthew says, the hungry hussy, put the butter down and it ain't, it's not, it's not boiling, screaming, it's not burning, it's just melting down. Perfect for cooking an egg. I mean, you know, you cook an egg in the house, you get you a, a frying pan and every how you cook it with butter or, or, or olive oil or whatever, you, uh, you cook it kind of low. You don't want the egg crusty and, and all that. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna crack an egg right here in the center. I'm gonna do two eggs. And there they are, they're just, uh, they're just hanging out, you know, taking it easy, you know, no, no worries. So uh, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna season these eggs. And I think I'm gonna put Smoked jalapeno blend on it. I like my eggs a little spicy in this Cajun bait. Ooh, the smoked jalapeno, it is wonderful. So we're just gonna let these eggs hang out a little bit. They're cooking really slow. I've got a plate ready. So uh, we'll come back here in just a second or two and uh, show you what's, what's gonna happen when we flip them. We're almost there, we're ready to eat. I'm gonna add some, some cheese to these potatoes also. That's gonna, that's gonna kick them up another notch. You know what I mean? Uh, layers and layers of flavor. Y'all stick around. Now it's time to flip these eggs. They're, they're looking really good. And uh, this black stone is so slick, you can't hardly get the spatula to get up under that egg. I think, I think that hungry hussy's onto something. Eggs are so hard to cook on it because they cook too fast. This is looking good. Though. I like the way these eggs are looking. Now I'm going to put a, about three slices of cheese on these potatoes and let that cheese melt. And about time it, about time it melts, we're going to sit down and enjoy this this uh, breakfast. The the home style home fried potatoes with sausage and zydeco chop chop and these wonderful eggs that uh, my friend the hungry hussy taught me how to do uh, it works out great so uh, I think we can go ahead and take those eggs up let me get a plug some potatoes right here on there like that and I'm going to put an egg on top of the cheese that's going to melt it on down and tell me that don't look good to you right there let's go to the table and let's get this devoured okay here we go I got to check out the yolks in these eggs oh yes that's that's perfect the hungry hussy like I said he got it together. He got the skills to pay the bills. Uh, thank you, Matthew, for the tip. It works for me over at Big Al's Eats. Let's, uh, let's get a little taste of all of this and see what we've done, done. What we've done, done. Mmm, man. Mmm, 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 mmm. Man, those potatoes. With the Zydeco Chop Chop on them, my goodness, they're good. Wiggle a little. 
put a little Cajun baked garlic blend on there too while they were cooking. Home run, folks. Home run. Man, that's good. And that cheese just, it adds a creaminess to the whole dish. This is very good. Mm -hmm. Hard to beat the potatoes, that's for sure. I'm in such a hurry, I can't even hang on to my fork. Y'all got your coffee out and stuff like that? Get you a cup of coffee, fry you up some eggs, do you some home fried potatoes, home style, home fry. Call them what you like, try them. Now don't forget to get your Cajun bait. And your Zydeco Chop Chop from CajunBait.com. And when you call over there, if you use the promo code Big Al, let me repeat there, I got a mouthful of taters and sausage. Use the promo code Big Al. They give you 10% off. Get you, get you a little discount. So thank y'all for watching me this morning. I enjoyed cooking this for you realize you're not getting to enjoy it but for those of you that have money and y'all bought them them phones with that smell of vision mm, get you some of this from big al's east y'all don't forget to like and share my page y'all have a nice afternoon from big al's east bone appetite